Hi everyone! I thought I would do a quick video on um, my recent purchase of the five piece summer hamper collection um, from Declior. Um, what I'm going to do is go through the products first and then I will do the second part of the video once I've tried them and I will tell you what I think. So we have here Neroli Biograde Bath and Shower Gel. I already have one of these and I have to say I absolutely adore it. What I do is I just wet my skin slightly, put a tiny, tiny amount on my skin, lather it all in, well it doesn't lather that much, but leave it on, shower it off and you have the most silky smooth skin. Um, it's amazing, it's almost like you don't have to apply um, body lotion afterwards, although I always do because I'm a little bit addicted to body lotion. So that's the first thing. Right. Second thing, this is the aloe vera sun biophase oil. Um, I've never tried a factor 30 oil before. I have used a factor 30, but never in an oil. Um, so when we next get a really good day, I will try that and let you know what I think. Um, it says it's antioxidant in it, so it's very good for the skin. Although the sun, generally speaking, isn't good for the skin, but. Um, we will see anyway. I am due a holiday soon, whether I get there or not, is another matter altogether. And then we have the Neroli, Neroli oil. Again, a full size. I don't know, I probably did mention, but this was £51 for the whole set, which is a bargain, you know, considering what each individual product would actually cost. So that comes in a little dropper bottle. I must admit, with these, um, it says you only need about five drops. No, I think it's, yeah, about five. I must admit, I do go a bit mad with them because they smell amazing. Neroli also is fantastic for stretch marks. So if you are pregnant and you don't want stretch marks, just massage a little bit of Neroli into the areas you think you're going to get them. I did that when I was pregnant and I didn't get one single stretch mark. Right. Um, 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 um. Body milk. Again, I have used their body milk before um, and I really, really like it. Don't quite know how far a small tube of this is going to go on me because I'm a bit over generous with <laughs> I squirt it on all over. But that's Neroli, so that will smell wonderful as well. Then we have the rose. I'm really, really looking forward to trying this. I'm going to smell this. Mm. That does smell gorgeous. So that is like this, only in a smaller size. I think what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to pop it into my bath um, because it's a smaller one. If I just put a tiny bit in my bath, it'll go a little bit further. But that smells absolutely amazing. Right, what else have we got? Hydraton anti tan another essential oil. Sorry, no, it's a rich day cream. This size isn't particularly generous, but I would imagine if you start off with the Neroli drops and then put this on over the top, it will go further. I also, before I put any moisturiser on or oil or anything, I always use a toner and I spray the toner onto my face and again, it's a lot easier to massage your, your moisturiser and your oils in. It goes a lot further as well. Let's just see what this smells like. Oh, that smells delicious. Very, very nice. Right, and lastly, we have... The Chica Botanic Balm. Now, I have never tried the Chica. I don't know if I've said that right. Is it Chica? Seeker? Eucalyptus. This is huge. Oh, get into it though. Right. I'm having a bit of a problem getting into it. Ah. I've actually grown my nails since um, lock up, lock, lock up, locked down. <laughs> it makes it harder to get into these things. So it's this, that is huge. That is, I can't see how many mils it is on here. 
50 mils for a balm. That, that is very generous. Oh, wow. That is gorgeous. That You can really smell the eucalyptus on it. I wouldn't use it too near your eyes or you'll probably end up crying, but that smells amazing. And they usually include a little spatula, which they have, yes. Never put your fingers into the pot because you'll be putting bacteria backwards and forwards. So always use the spatula that they suggest. But I don't know if you can actually see that. It's a shame there's not smelly vision on here because it just, I think this would be great for my husband. He suffers with sinus problems and this would be lovely for his skin. He could breathe easily all night. That is wonderful, that smell. So 51 pounds, I think, for five products, which full size, full size, sorry, these two are full size. This one's full size. You've got your full size. Is amazing value for money. So what I'm going to do is test out these products for the next couple of days and I will tell you what I thought of them. I already know that I'm gonna love the balm because the smell is divine. But um, yes, so please, please stick with the video um, and I will tell you what I thought. But um, if you haven't already ordered this from QVC, they've got 60 day money back guarantee at the moment and you can try as much or as little of the product as you like and they'll still accept returns. So it's a no brainer really. Um, this, Next hot day, definitely, but I'm really intrigued by this, actually. I've just, I just can't imagine putting a Factor 30 oil on. Normally when you go sort of Factor 30 upwards, they're normally quite thick and gloopy, but I'm, I'm so looking forward to trying this. Hmm. Right, that's it for me, and I will be back in the next couple of days when I've tried the products, and to tell you what I thought of them. Speak to you soon. Hello, I've come back again and I have tried these products. So here is what I thought of them. Okay, so this one, Factor 30 Biophase um, Sun Protection, I have tried it on and it feels absolutely divine. However, we haven't actually had a hot sunny day where I can actually test out the SPF whether it is actually 30 because quite often you'll buy something that's a high protection and either it's lower or higher or it doesn't do what it says. But anyway, it's absolutely gorgeous on the skin. Um, it also has, it's UVA and UVB, so not only is it protecting you from the harmful rays of the sun from burning, it's also got a good anti-aging filter in there as well. Um, I tried, I have tried this already in another, because I've already got one of these, and I really recommend this. Um, putting it all over the dry skin first, hopping in the shower and showering off will give you the most amazing silky soft skin when you come out of the shower. This body milk is beautiful. Um, unfortunately, it's only a small size, and I do tend to use an awful lot of body milk. Um, this is rich in coconut oil, I think it said, yeah, coconut and vitamin E. Now, if you've got any blemishes, scar tissue, or um, you've picked a scab, or you've been bitten, or anything else, vitamin E is amazing for your skin. It will really help to heal your skin quickly. So that is really good, really, really good. Uh, we have the Nurette Day Cream, right? This is very rich. Two, I found, I've got kind of a normal combination mature skin. Basically, it's um, a bit of everything. Anyway, it's uh, it's not particularly dry at the moment. This is very very rich. I would recommend this either at night or possibly in October when your central heating goes back on and um, you know the heating is sapping all the moisture from your skin you know each to their own I just found it a little bit too rich to have underneath makeup it didn't work for me but like I say at night I will use it or I will tend to even in sort of like winter time when you need an extra thick layer of protection 
Um, it doesn't have any UVA protection in there as well, so I wouldn't use it in the summer. This is the Neroli Aramescence. Um, I absolutely love Neroli on my skin. Um, it, each person is different and we all tend to find a product or an essential oil that really, really works for us. And I know that um, Declior are famed for their Aramescence and their, I think it's Iris Oil, they say is great for mature skin as well but I love Neroli the smell the texture everything you only need a few drops I think they say five to seven I must admit I tend to actually be a bit more generous with it and then I tend to do a nice lymph massage in and last of all we have sorry I've got something in my mouth the Chica Botanical Oil, Botanical, no, sorry, Chica Botanic Balm. This is the one that's slightly menthol. It felt absolutely divine on my skin and I've used it at night. However, don't put it anywhere near your eyes because it, it made my eyes just a bit runny because of the, the vapour. But um, Chica is amazing for, if you've got very dehydrated skin or maybe you've been in the sun and you've got sunburn and it's really, really tight and red. This would be really, really good for that. So I think, oh, one more thing. I tried, where, oh, no, no, go back. This oil in the rose, yeah, the rose, the orient. I tried that in my bath the other night. Um, when I came out of the bath, got dressed and everything, um, my husband said, what's that smell in the house? It's gorgeous. I said, what smell? He says, oh, it's just the most beautiful smell in the house. And as I got nearer to him, he said, actually, it's you. <laughs> um, he absolutely loved the smell on me. I smelt it in the bath and it was a really nice experience bathing in it. But it lingered on my skin afterwards. I think once your nose becomes acclimatised to it, you don't actually smell it anymore. But he smelt it on my skin for a good few hours afterwards. And I have to say, we have a downstairs bathroom because we live in an older property um the downstairs of my house apparently because like I said I was a little bit nose blind at that point smelled absolutely divine the next day as well so um it's a really really beautiful product I almost wish they'd given me that in this size because like I said I've tried this before um but if they do it on its own or um in a big size I will definitely buy because it, the smell you know to get comments and I wasn't wearing perfume or anything like that he just said I just smelled gorgeous so that was nice anyway I hope that has um, helped you decide whether you want to buy this kit and given you a bit of insight into what I uh, feel about the products and I hope to be doing another video soon so please come back and join me um, please comment what you thought of the video underneath any nice comments please <laughs> and um, subscribe to my channel that would be wonderful thank you very much for watching bye bye